uh, demonstrate on how to assist a, a patient to sit on the bed uh, and transferring a patient from bed to chair and to wheelchair. Let's go! First, identify yourself and verify the client's identity. Explain to the client what you are going to do, why it is necessary, and how the client can cooperate. Good morning, sir. Uh, Mr. Jiro Inoue, right? Yes, I am. Uh, I am Michelle Perez. I came from University of the Assumption student nurse. Uh, I'm here to uh, assist you. Uh, uh, to sit on your bed. Second, perform hand hygiene and observe other appropriate infection control procedures. Provide for client privacy. Position yourself and the client appropriately before performing the move. How? Assist the client to a lateral position facing you. Second, position the client feet and lower legs at the edge of the bed. Stand beside the client's hips and face the far corner of the bottom of the head. Lean your trunk forward from the hips. Flex your hips, knees, and ankles. How to move the client to a sitting position? Place one arm around the client's shoulder and the other arm beneath both of the client's tights near the knees. Then, tighten your gluteal abdominal, leg, and arm muscles. Lift the client tight slightly. And lastly, document all relevant information. What should be recorded? The ability of the client to assist in moving and turning. And last, response of client to moving and turning. How to transfer between bed and chair? First, Assist the client to a sitting position on the side of the bed. Then, place the chair parallel to the bed as close as to the bed as possible. Assess the client for orthostatic hypotension before moving the client from the bed. Do you feel drowsy right now, sir? No. Give explicit instruction to the client. Ask the client to move forward and sit on the edge of the bed. Lean forward slightly from the hips. Place the foot of the stronger leg beneath the edge of the bed and put the other foot forward. The client should not grasp your neck for support. Place the client's hand on the bed surface or on your shoulder. Then. The client should not grasp your neck for support. How to position? 
execute correctly. Stand directly in front of the client. Linear drop forward from the hips. And circle the client waist with your arms. You should tighten your gluteal, abdominal, leg, and arm muscle. On the count, one, two, three, ask the client to push with back foot. Support the client in an upright standing position for a few moments. Then, take a few steps toward the chair. Ensure the client's safety. Ask the client to push back into chair. Then, apply a seatbelt as necessary. Transferring between bed and wheelchair. This transferring between bed and wheelchair is like transferring between bed and chair. But, take note. Ensure to lock the brakes of the wheelchair. Get the wheelchair parallel to the patient. Move forward and sit to the edge of the bed. Lean forward slightly from hips. Stand directly in front of the client. Lean your trunk forward from the hips. Tighten your gluteal, abdominal, leg, and arm muscle. On the count, one, two, three, ask the client to push back with back foot. Together, steps toward the wheelchair. Ask the client to push back into the wheelchair seat. Then, make sure that the brakes are locked. And that's the end of our demonstration. I'm Clark as director. I'm Paul as the cameraman and director. I'm Lichelle as the nurse. I'm Jiro as the patient. And we are from the University of Bye-bye.